everybody, this is Mike at webmasterlessons.com and today I will be showing you how to make a image pop up in Flash using ActionScript 3. Here is an example. You see how it pops up and then when I take my mouse off of it, it pops down to the original size that you saw in the beginning. So here you go, once again. Okay, now let's get started. The first thing you want to do is open up Action Script 3, which is located once you open your um, Flash. Okay, now you got a blank stage. You don't have to change the stage type right now because I will be just showing you an example. So the first thing you're going to want to do is um, import an image to the stage. So I'll just import flash image. All right. Um, another thing you're gonna, going to want to do is you will actually go to your timeline, um, create a, a second layer the second layer call it actions your first layer you're gonna call it pop-up okay so for your um, first layer you're going to um, just open that up and just put stop just for now and then go back to your timeline and you go to your pop-up and then you make it small then you create another key frame another frame within the pop-up layer press F6 right um make that wider as wide as you want you go back to the first frame convert that to a symbol I put my registration point in the middle and I'm just gonna keep it at symbol one. And I made that a movie clip. Then I go to frame two. I convert that to a symbol as well. I'll keep that as symbol two as a movie clip. Okay. So now you're gonna wanna um, create another keyframe in the actions layer two. I mean frame two, excuse me okay so you got that set up so it should be looking like this right now we're gonna pop in some code but before we do that um you go to on um, pop up frame one you make an instance name of whatever you like so I'm just gonna put it image one and then you go to the second frame and pop up layer and then you give it the same instance name image one okay now we're gonna pop in the code for um, frame one in actions okay um so and we're in um, frame one and we're in actions so remember we created a stop and um, we put our instance name here which we named it image1 and we had a add event listener to towards that and then for the mouse event it's going to be mouse over and then we're going to um, set up a function and we're going to call the function we here we here you could name the function whatever you like right then after that we're going to um, put a curly brace and then go to and stop to so now um, since we've done that part we um, open up frame 2 in the actions and once we do that what we are go going to do is um, put the instance name we're going to add the event listener and then it's going to be considered mouse out and then we're gonna um, call this image small because that would just basically be more understandable for the function and we add a void towards it 
curly braids then go and stop to frame number one and then our our end result once we do that we press control enter and we should get our result and it should look like this so there you go you have your image popping out so what can be a benefit is, from this is if you want if you want to make like a image gallery with thumbnails popping out um, you can just set them all up as you like create your own stage and you have the code and what you do in order to um, create multiple ones is basically you are going to create um, more instances of um, images small and big name the second image image 2 small and big do is you're going to um, like for example I'm just going to copy this control C and then I'm going to um, control V and I'll just call this image 2 and I would do the same thing for frame 1 and I'll just add control V we here and image 2 and when you render it out it would work you would have no problems at all and that's how you um, create a thumbnail gallery that pops up in flash using action script 3 i hope you enjoyed this tutorial and the source code will be available at webmasterlessons.com under the um, flash video sections of the website and thank you for watching and um, stay tuned for more tutorials. You guys have a great day.